Over six billion people are on Earth. You see hundreds, maybe even thousands of them every day. They are the people next to you in the supermarket line, the man that cut you off in traffic, and the child at the bus stop. The people you see are not the background to your life story. They have their own families and dreams. Jews, Catholics, Muslims, Greeks, Koreans, Americans, lawyers, students, and farmers make up the world in which you live. Among these are the good, the bad, the noble, and the criminal. Included in these are individuals trying to make a difference. They are people like everyone else, some famous, some not, but they are making a mark in the world. In Las Vegas, one man is making his mark in an unusual way. I'm out here eight to 10 hours a day, seven days a week. Been out here five years, man, on the same corner. I ain't missed a day yet. I entertain more than Wayne Newton, uh, all those guys on, on I, I entertain more than all the big celebrities down on the main strip, but they entertain for money. I'm out here for free. I'm out here just to make people happy, man. So that's why I love doing it. And plus, it's like a hobby to me. You know, some people uh, collect stamps, some people, uh, do different things for a hobby. This is my hobby. If you're gonna be insane, be insane for, for the Lord. That's what I say. But I got all my senses. I got all my marbles, and I just want to uh, spread love and joy to all mankind. You know what I'm saying? People come up to me. They say, "Man, I was having a bad day, and I seen you, and you, you made me have a good day." That's more than money can ever buy. That makes me really happy when people uh, come and tell me that. Kids, oh, they all come and tell me that. Just waiting to see me. You know what I'm saying? They start their day off. That's my mission, man, is to uh, make, 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 anybody that's having a bad day, make, make them smile, man, you know. I think everybody is on this earth to do something, man. This is my, uh, this is my work for the, uh, uh, for mankind, you know what I'm saying? Everybody have a, a nine to five, but I think we have a, a, a work obligation to mankind, too. That's what I think. Everything that's happened to me, God is what's doing it. God makes a way for me. God is what's making, uh, Making, making it possible for me to do this, because I'm nothing like God. Mm -hmm. Yeah, he gave me the power to do this. Before, uh, before I did this, I did uh, 20 years proudly in the uh, U.S. Army, 1st Cavalry, 1st Cavalry, uh, Fort Hood, Texas. 20 years, baby. I was born in Lake Charles, Louisiana, and my uncle, he was a, a, a guitar player, and he used to go to the uh, neighborhood store and play the guitar. And I used to dance with him at three years old. Like I say some people are, are, are born to do certain things in life. Uh -huh. I was born feet first, and I was born a year to horse, and I think that my feet was, is used to, uh, to entertain people, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> I'm, like, I'm like Sammy Davis Jr. Jr. In Sacramento, California, uh, I went to a preschool, and a little girl, she called me Mr. Happiness. She said I, I made her happy, so I stuck with that name. Yeah, but my real name is Larry Johnson, same as a basketball, basketball player. Grandma, Ma, Mr. Happiness is my mission name, you know, to uh, make everybody have a, a nice day, man. This is my uh, place that I've come to retire because I love all these people. It's like, it's like a melting pot of all nationality of people. It's not dominated by one. It's, everybody is like mixed in Vegas, you know what I'm saying? There's a whole new world other than that strip, you know. There's other things you can do in Vegas. The only reason I go down the strip, I drive down the strip because my granddaughter likes to see the lights and stuff. I hardly ever go to this trip at all. I've been married to my wife. We, we uh, uh, next month, well, in a couple of days, October 4th, we've been married uh, 30 years. Something to be proud of, because when we first got married, everybody say we weren't going to last five minutes. So uh, I, love, I love proving people wrong. Yeah, I have, I have a son that's 27 and a daughter that's 24. And I have a granddaughter that's three years old. She was born on Michael Jackson's uh, birthday. She's already moonwalking already. I was jogging one day, man, and all of a sudden, uh, I was going to bring my guitar out here one day, and I brought my guitar out, and all of a sudden, people started liking it, man. I was out here one day, it was like 150 out here, man, but it was so hot, but I kept on jamming, man, because, you know, a job, I mean, show business is, is, is hard business, but I love it, man. One day, I was out here playing my guitar, and some guy threw some uh, uh, hot car foul over me. One time, a guy sprayed mace in my eyes. I was in pain for like two hours, man. I was really in pain, but I kept on doing my show. One time some guys threw some rocks and hit me on the side of the face. 
most of the guys give me the, the bird, but they don't do it like much as usual. Every now and then, uh, guys give me the finger, that kind of thing. But those guys, when I, when I see people like that, I tell them that people are jerks within. That means that they hate themselves. So, because I'm not doing nothing to make people do that. That means that they really hate themselves when they do that to other people. That's what I think. I don't, I don't care what people think or whatever, because I know who I am and I know what I'm all about. So, my grandma said, people are going to talk about you when you're doing good. They're going to talk about you when you're doing bad. So, forget what people say. Enjoy yourself. As long as you ain't hurting nobody in life, don't go by what people say. You know what I'm saying? As long as you know yourself. Because I know what I'm all about. I know I'm, I'm on a mission. The world is a big old, uh, is in turmoil right now, man. But when the world's in turmoil, that means you, you have to be in turmoil. You got to have peace within. Yeah. The world's going crazy. That means you got to be crazy. You have to be wild. You don't. You got to mm -hmm. keep joy and peace within no matter what's going on. I was a kid, man. My mother shot hair on in a, she was in and, out of, in and out of prison and stuff. And I was raised by my grandmother. My grandmother put me on the right track as far as respecting people, you know, giving love and joy. But my mother, uh, she destroyed her life. Uh, three of my little sisters were born on heroin. So I go around and tell the kids that uh, their parents are in jail. I let them know that my mother was in jail and I overcame. You can overcome too. So I have a special burden on those kind of kids, you know, uh, in, inmate kids. So I go talk to a lot of inmate kids and let them know that you can make it, man. I know what you guys are going through. I went through it. A lot of people say, I should go on the strip. I make a lot of money, but I'm not in it for the money. I'm in it for the love of it. When you love something, you do it for nothing.